Everyone deserves a chance, Mom. Even the worst people. Anyone can change. Even Chloe? Yes, even Chloe. Keep in mind that she's only 14. She's still learning how to make moral judgments. Excuse me, but you can't say that. Oh, I can't say what? You know, the thing about Chloe. She had her chance, but... <clears throat> Good thing I always carry duct tape with me. Mm. Ahem! Huh? Mm. You're afraid of bugs? Yeah, it's all because of Chloe. Oh, sweetheart. I used to be just like you. Really? Yeah, when I was your age, I was super afraid of bugs. Luckily, two nice kids helped me overcome my fear. Uh, tell me more! Ah, oh, bugs! Get them off! Yes! Fear the bugs, Baker boy! Uh, wait a minute. What's wrong? From up close, the bugs don't look all that scary. What? I imagine them to be much bigger. Anthony, what is the meaning of this? I don't know. The others said he hated bugs. I know what's wrong. The bugs you caught are all average. Average? Yeah, just like you. You're the best, miss. Thanks to you, I'm not afraid anymore. Huh? You were great too, class rep Anthony. Actually, my name is... Anthony! My queen, no! Wow, they sound like such nice people. I wonder what they're doing these days. Dear, would you like a croissant from the bakery? Anthony, you know how I feel about this place. You're absolutely right. I should never become mayor in the first place, and such an excellent teacher as you should never have been fired. Hmm? So we're going to fix this. By the powers vested in me, I now reinstate you to your position. Huh? What are you doing? My husband can't do such a cowardly and ridiculous thing. You're absolutely right, Audrey darling. By the powers vested in me, I divorce you and award myself custody of Zoe because she's done nothing to deserve the terrible mother that you are, and I like her the best. What? Um, isn't this kind of out of character? Whatever. Once the villain is defeated, his wife will have forgotten about it anyway. You resigned from office? I'm sorry, darling, but I had no other choice. Gabriel betrayed me. What? Gabrikins would never do such a thing. I know it's hard to believe, but I'm telling the truth. Liar! Grr, I'm so mad at you, Anthony. Well, as long as you still love me. Love you? Anthony, you're so fired. Ah, don't kill me. Huh? Amelia. What? You're not class rep anymore. I'm so sorry, my queen. Audrey, stop. You two are very good friends, remember? Andre? Yes, dear? I... never mind. Hold on, did you just call me Andre? Um, no. Because I think I heard you call me by my actual name. Which means you still love me, since the only other name you get right is Gabriel. Andre, that's not true at all! How lovely, you said my name again. Shut up, Andre! Gabriel? Emily, you're awake! What happened? My love, I used the power of the miraculous to bring you back to life! Wait, you got the miraculous? Yes, isn't it great? Thanks to the miraculous, we're finally reunited! Hold the phone! But doesn't that mean somebody else had to die in my place? Yeah? So? What matters is that you're alive! Gabriel, that's so cruel! You're responsible for somebody's death! Calm down, the person who died probably wasn't that important anyway. You don't know that. I'm sure they'll be missed. Meanwhile... <coughs> S-sweetheart? Told you the writers were up to no good! Anthony! 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 Audrey, you know my name is Andre. Yeah, yeah. Why do you keep calling me Anthony then? Well, because... Do I really mean that little to you? No, it's nothing against you, Andre. It's just, the name is very special to me. Special? In what regard? Well... Uh, uh. Dear, look, she's about to say her first words. Uh, Anthony! Mm. Who's Anthony? I have absolutely no idea. Have I ever offered a single bad idea to you, Andre? We've always helped each other out, haven't we? Alliance, add a romantic filter and send the video to Audrey Bourgeois. Hmm? We've always helped each other out, haven't we? We sure have, Gabriel Kuhn. Anthony Kuhn, daisuke da yo! Huh? Anthony, you cheater! Yeah. Huh? Did you hear that? It sounded like Audrey yelling. I was yelling, you idiot! Yelling, you're fired! 
It's not the flamethrower! Ah, get this crazy woman away from me! Ah.